gets us about eight top view okay and go please Yeah, it is. Yeah. So, looking at the one second pulse here, what we got? 12. No, 22. 22 penetration. So, yeah, go ahead with 30 seconds, please, dude. Uh, you got any more there? Yeah, continuous firing for 30 seconds, dude. Them some loud guns. I'm really far away. I like how the one in the middle is just kind of skating in a straight line. I think he's through the core actually, and they've gone to dumbfire. Yep. Yeah, he can stop now. Okay, so 30 seconds. I had to move away because it was just a bit too loud. Uh, 30 seconds gives us a nice pattern. It looks like after he punched through, he's actually split to gunfire, and that's where we've got this additional pattern at the top of the side there. So that's where the gun stopped focusing. Um, but yeah, uh, really nasty damage uh, that it's done to the, to the block. But uh, in, in, interestingly, it's in a wedge shape, if you see it there. So this is going to cut, but in a horizontal line. So that's interesting. Oh, that's Alright then, so we're going to move on to the bobbies, so, uh, no, no, wait, one shot test, do that first. One click on your, uh, the same gun that we were just looking at. Same gun, huh? That did really well, it nearly made it to the, uh, fifth layer there. That's not bad at all. Punctured layer four, but didn't that didn't breach it. So nice. Uh, just for the giggles, do you want to uh, shoot it with your other gun? See what that does. Not for giggles. Do it for science. Okay, that one also punctured layer four, but didn't breach it. So interestingly, they've got a similar, in fact, the first gun has better uh, penetration, but the, uh, yeah, it's interesting, it looks like the first, the second one's more precise. Okay, in any case, uh, do you want to give it a missile bombardment? Yeah, nice one. I think some of them may have missed. 
Oh, <laughs> they're grazing along the bottom. That's one way to break the test, though. <laughs> Shoot along the bottom. That's all right. Here come the top ones. I'll give it a bit of a bombardment. Okay. All right, lovely. Let's get on to the bobbies. Have fun. DPS off. You're gonna, have to, you're gonna have to hit that core, buddy. Oh my god, that is loud. That's better. A little bit better. Oh my god. They're going for it. And this thing's looking like a bit of an apple core right now. He's still firing. <laughs> He's punched through. He's just not quite hitting the core yet. <laughs> Do we have a loot cloud? Yeah, we've got a loot cloud confirmed. You can stop shooting now. <laughs> There's nothing left to this guy. He's hollowed out and there's nothing left at the front. <laughs> Good job, bro. Good job. And it looks like you have no damage at all to your ship. So well done. Here she goes. I'm going to try and stay with the trigger. I'll try not to get decloaked. Okay. Oh, wow. Is he shooting at me? I'm not, I'm not cloaked. Huh. I am cloaked even. Right, here we go. It's coming for you. Ooh. That's not damage, is it? No, it's not damage. However, the triggers seem better days. Triggers fired missiles. Oh, it's going for ramming. Oh no, collision. We got a collision. Oh, oh dear. You took it hard then, mate. Be careful with the collisions. You took some damage. You glitched through your shields. My cloak is still active. Okay, so it's all going well. Mark 8 is still pulling in on him though. Oh, it looks like we've got a crash. Oh no, we're back, we're back, we're back. Oh, I'm gonna go and sit with this guy because he's not moving as much. Do you know what? If the trigger keeps attacking you head on, it's gonna take a long time to get to the core. Oh no, it's trying to get under your belly. Your shields are red. Yeah, he's pulling away. Ooh, that looks painful. Get too far away, then that's flight, not Unspoken fight. Ring out yeah, it's flight, not fight, basically. If, if you get so far away that the AI becomes inactive, then he's considered the winner by default. You're still alive, though. Still alive, and so is he. What's happened? You're dead. Energy appears to be dead. Oh really? But how? The turret's still. The, the ship's still alive. It's not overheating. Okay, so we had a good run, but uh, looks like the Mark Eight did did uh, was angry, and sealed the deal. So it looks like we've got a kill shot coming in, uh, which pretty much rips the hole right through to the core from here and uh, punches out the other side. So we've got holes there, and there, and another one next to it as well, which you can barely see. Uh, the final blow came through this shot here. Um, went through, 
through, through, through, and into the core right there. Boom! And then it punched out the other side. But you know. Um, let's have a look at the front where most of the damage will be. So let's see. It's not too bad actually. In fairness, it, this ship came off really well. I'm going to do a couple of pass by just to show it. Battle scarred rope. Oh boy. Something's moving. There's energy in it again now. The whole thing moved. But yeah, there it is. I might let him have a go at the Mark 9 just for fun, but. Uh, Pretty much, yeah, that's it. Stage two. Probably could do with a bit more thrust. I don't know. I'm not really sure. But uh, I don't really like people. I don't really like telling people what to build. I, yeah, I like people doing what they like. And it must have been hard making this to scale. So, right. Let's get rid of that. Uh, let's get rid of that angry V8. Oh my god, I've done something crazy. Whoa! What did I push? <laughs> what did I do? Um, guys, so thanks to Energy for bringing his ship along. We had a great little battle here. Managed to get to stage two, which is a pretty good achievement considering the uh, mobility, um, the unfairness <laughs> in the difference of mobility. Um, and also a really detailed ship. Again, be based on the EVE Online Roke, which is a Kaldari battleship, and hand-built. No models involved here. So uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.